Hey folks, this is JK from the Ministry of Otaku coming to you from Round Rock, Texas at the, Kalam, at the Kalahari uh, Resort and Convention Center in Round Rock, Texas here for ClausaCon, Texas and this is Day Zero it's pretty much uneventful especially at the uh, convention area which is at the lower level of the uh, of this building believe it or not it's very uneventful very unevent uneventful normally you see uh, crazy uh, antics or or day zero cosplay but it's just uh, only a few people around groups of five or six hanging about and there are some attendees that are actually wearing masks but even though Texas has abolished their mask mandate on March 2021 uh, some people do wear masks for other reasons primarily because they're they have immune compromised systems or because they are so psychologically used to them but it doesn't matter most people are not wearing masks here and America is still a free country but for me at least I had a decent time for day zero ate dinner with uh, five other people all them Congos and and all of them came here because their home conventions have pretty much, unfortunately, have embraced the Clone Chan wokeness. Which is pretty much a shame. I mean, that's the real reason why I went to uh, Amy Matsui 2021. Because all Con had, had imposed a mass mandate, and as a result, is actually considered the worst Oricon ever. And that because, primarily because of the mass mandate and for other reasons as well. Which I already uh, think I may have written it down. Yeah, I definitely written it down, but I haven't made a video about it yet. From, from what I heard, there's going to be a lot of people coming on, uh, on Friday and throughout the uh, and throughout the convention, a lot of people that's gonna come here. Uh, from what I heard, Texas has its own convention circuit. It's even, everything is bigger in Texas, and, and Texas is so big that it has its own convention circuit. My convention circuit is in, is in the uh, DC metropolitan area, but Texas has its own convention cir circuit, circuit in, within its own state. And this is my second convention I went to in Texas. The first one was in Matsuri. This is the second. Costcon is the second. And it may not be the last. Ugh. I mean, seriously, I'm looking forward to Costcon Texas. See what happens. And if I get any good, uh, photos or videos at the war park that would be really wonderful but everything is going slowly there's gonna be a lot of people coming here eventually people will come but since it's been 18 months since we have a normal fun uh, anime convention season, a lot of people who are usually will come to an anime convention are either still staying home or are willing to go to these uh, their normal conventions that have been fully crunch and woke. Now there are many other people like me that are willing to travel to conventions that are perfectly normal. Such as Anime Masui and Anime, uh, 
I mean, in, in Clausicon, Clausicon, Texas. And I think the uh, the conventions that are run by the same company as uh, Clausicon, Nostalgia Conventions, where it looks like they are hell-bent on operating as normal. As in complete normalcy. Ichiban Khan, they're going to be operating as normal in, uh, in their state. Anyway, I'm, going, I'm definitely going to come to you on uh, on Friday with more footage of uh, Clausicon. Hoping, uh, hoping Friday will be a lot better because it's going to be a lot better with all these people that are going to flow in. I think a lot of people are going to come in on Friday. But I'm signing out right now. See you.